Hello, this is Melorian, and this will be a 35 point game. My Darius up against Gordon. Alright, so the game we've got going on here, it's called Bunkers. And so, what you're trying to do is control the zone to your right. Uh, if you get do that, uh, get two points, you win. Uh, it's going to be pretty tough, though. You, we do have reserves that are going to be coming on here. So, anyway, what I have is I have Old Rowdy, I have Darius, I have a Centurion, I have an Ironclad, I have a Defender. I have a hunter, and then my reserves is going to be a lancer, and of course I got my little half jacks there. And then for him over here, he has the big old bear. He has his forge guard. He's got two drillers. He's got the boker there, and then uh, Thor at the back, and just yeah, all these forge guard guys here around uh, Gordon. And his reserves over there is he has uh, all his high shields, and then this other little solo. So anyway, going into this game, I was a little bit worried about all these different uh, Forge Guard guys, just because I didn't have a lot of anti-infantry, but I do have a lot of shooting. So as he comes in, I'm just hoping to really knock off these drillers, and then I'm going to have to see what I have to do with these Forge Guard once they got close enough. So my turn, I just really march on up using Crane on Centurion to get even more room and also going and casting on Fortify onto him just to make him that much tougher. Uh, Fortify is going to be a big thing in this is because you can't be pushed and everyone in base to base with you can't be pushed. So it's kind of a, a straight counter to my opponent's feet. So his turn one and he actually does something really interesting that I didn't really expect. Uh, he bre breaks off and he has the bear with the one boker go off to the left and meanwhile all of his other units are there on to the right. So he's really making sure I'm not going to score and yet he's still putting in a significant amount of points to try and score on his own. So now I had the good old plan of what I can do is just try and shoot off his drillers while he's coming in but then my combat elements will switch over and I'm going to try and eliminate what he has here on the left and be really ahead in points. Uh, meanwhile, whenever my Lancer comes in, maybe that should be my answer, answer to his Forge Guard because he can just get in there and start stabbing, stabbing, stabbing. Or if nothing else, I can be bashing one of his drillers with a shield just to steal off the Cortex. So my turn two, that's uh, kind of what I do. I start working on his left driller. Uh, I do quite a bit of damage to him. I think it's about 15 boxes in total. Uh, I did not bring my Lancer on yet because he wasn't close enough. And then meanwhile, you can see I have a lot of my jacks there in base to base with the Centurion just in case he tries dragging me over. And Old Rowdy is there ready to go and smash the bear if he gets too close. So his turn two, this is the time he's going to be bringing in his reserves, and you can see they're coming in. Uh, the bear also hops over the lake there, the little swamp, and he thinks he's safe for me for charge ranges, but I don't think he realizes that uh, with Crane I'm well within range. Uh, otherwise, he goes and he fixes up his driller a bit with Thor, and he moves up, but he's, he's fairly cautious here, and I like how he got pretty close to the board edge so that my Lancer is in good striking position. Uh, one thing that is hurting though is he's starting to shoot my hunter with Gordon and he's doing some, well not bad damage, not just taking anything and destroying it, but he's doing some real damage to me. So my turn three, my Lancer comes on in, uh, goes after the driller and bang bang bang, all of a sudden he has no cortex and I stab and kill one of the forge guard. Uh, shooting continues into the left driller and I do a bunch more damage again. Uh, just like I had planned, over I send off my uh, old Rowdy to go mess up the bear, and I was really surprised I, I didn't do more damage. Uh, I think I got about a little bit average dice rolls, but I mean that bear is one tough guy, so uh, it's going to take a little while to get it done. Uh, meanwhile, I just threw a little half jack into the zone, just to try and make it so that uh, I'm hoping this forge guard is going to go over and try and shoot him and get out of uh, shield wall so that I can go and... Well, try and kill him. So in response, he on the left uh, starts attacking me with the bear, but gets some pretty bad luck. That's kind of the way my opponent goes. And then the boker comes in and does a shield bash, and he's hoping not to knock me away three inches, just so I'm knocked down and he can keep on hitting. But he knocks me away three inches, so that's just perfect for me. Uh, meanwhile, he tries bashing away at the uh, lancer, but... Thanks to set defense, he has a bunch of missed, missed attacks, and even though I take a lot of damage and I lose my shield, I'm still there. Uh, he also shoots at my hunter, does more damage, uh, my movement is out now, 
but uh, otherwise this is still isn't so bad. I'm loving how he's having to deal with that Landsworth so much and hopefully my next turn can really put me in the lead. So my turn four, I get back up with old Rowdy and man he does awesome. Uh, thanks to my feet I'm able to completely heal up old Rowdy and my hunter. Old Rowdy kills the bear and his handler and the boker on that side so fantastic work. Uh, I also shot a shot into those high shields, but no such luck. Uh, shooting into the driller really messed him up. I mean, he's, he's practically dead at this point. And uh, otherwise, I'm just still with the Centurion just trying to, to wait there. So if that driller ever moves up, I can mess it up. So his turn four then. He uh, now is able to scrap the Lancer, but hey, that guy did his, his job. Uh, Meanwhile, he, he has the little driller there just kind of moved up, and behind the driller is Gorton. So I think he's trying to set up for some sort of a assassination or something. But, of course, with my Centurion Fortify, it's going to be tough. Uh, he moves into the zone with the high shields, which triggers my counter charge, and I come over and I kill one with old Rowdy. And then his other little solo guy does a little spray and puts me on fire, but really that's not a big worry. My turn five, and at this point I'm starting to wonder if I'm going to win via Death Clock, but uh, Old Rowdy goes and kills off two more guys on the left side. Uh, his driller that's closest to me is now completely destroyed, and I'm really just lining up with my uh, Ironclad and my Centurion just to go and finish things off if he gives me the opportunity. His turn five, though, he tries to be a little bit more aggressive. Uh, he moves up a bit with Gordon, tries doing some shooting at my hunter again, and he just really hates that hunter, and uh, he sets up that wall, but the way it is, you know, I got reach with uh, Centurion, so if I can get in there and just hit him once, I'm pretty sure it's over. And that's really what happens. I send him over with full focus, and uh, just, you know, boost to hit the first time, and thanks to the sustained attack on the piston spear, it's just boom, 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 and he's dead. So victory to uh, Darius, and really in this game, I just felt that uh, the main thing here is that I had the perfect thing to counter his feet, and my shooting just picked him apart. Uh, I think looking back at what he did, I think his mistake was splitting his forces. Uh, he should have gone more down the center, and then just been more aggressive. You know, he didn't really have any shooting, his stuff is all combat, he really had to get into my face. But uh, instead, he was just a little bit too cautious. And, you know, maybe it was just a really bad matchup for him. Of course, he had his typical bad dice. But, hey, things went uh, perfectly to my plan and had a lot of fun. So, hope you had fun watching it. Thanks. Bye.